What is happening guys? Jim the Game Guru. Okay, today we're going to dig into a super tiny game that plays really, really fast. Here we go. It's Couch Skeletons. Um, yeah, super cheap game at 10 bucks. Excellent quality cards. Super fast to play. And it's actually kind of fun. And mm -hmm. I'm here with my daughter, Aleana. She ends up beating me every time I get on these videos. I don't know what the deal yeah, is. I'm a master. Yeah, okay. Yeah, you know, I'm supposed to be the game viewer, not you. No, I'm the master. You just, uh, okay. How would guys, how would we do this? We could switch <laughs> to his channel for my channel and say, Ollie, I know all the time. No, yeah, no, yeah, no. yeah, we'll do that. All right, so we're going to flip this around. I'm going to do a how to play on this. And I really love like these little tiny games like this that are easy to carry and take on the go with you. And yeah, it's a little bit of a filler game. But man, if I had a choice between interacting with somebody and playing a, a, a good quality game, it's a filler game, it has actually it actually has excellent quality cards versus being on my on my mobile phone, I think I would choose the interaction. So let's go ahead and dig in. We'll do a, I'll show you a quick how to play. All right, so let's dig into some how to play couch skeletons. All right, so what we have here in the center is we have a couch and the couch has five seats. And what we're going to do is on each player's turn, you draw up to three cards and you can play up to three cards. Now, whatever card, whatever cards you have in your hand, you have to discard at least one card at the end of your turn to your discard play pile. At each player, this is a two player game, two player only. Yeah, that's what the couch looks like. You've got to bring it down a little bit here. There you go. Um, so each player has their own deck and their own discard pile. Now, there's two rules to putting a skeleton down. One is you have to have it one number higher than a skeleton that's already on the seat if you place it over. Or you can have a card that's one number lower or higher on the side. So now we will show you exactly what we're talking about as we start to dig in. Let me show you the instructions here. It's kind of cute how they package the instructions. The instructions are actually on these little cards. So it, it says instructions 104, instructions 204, and then instructions 304, and then 404. That goes into complete instructions for the entire game on each one of these cards. Do you have to follow both rules at the same time when you're putting your skeletons down? No, you do not. When you place a skeleton down, you only have to follow one of the rules. That's it. One of the rules. Okay, so let's go ahead and go. So when you, what we do is when we start off the game, both players will draw the very first card off their... Nope, do the first card off your deck. And then one put, person puts it on one side of the couch, and the other person puts it on the other couch, see? And then you have a 5 here and an 8 here on, on my pile. So, if the numbers are the same, you have to keep, you have to redo this part until the numbers are different. You cannot have the same number values on both sides. And I'll show you really quick what the card looks like. Very cute cards. I mean, the cards are high quality for a $10 game. The cards are very, very solid. They're very, they're thicker. I love the way they feel. And Aliana's going to show you her five card right there. You gotta bring it down a little bit like that. There you go. So there's a skeleton just yep. chilling on the couch. Just chilling. Yeah, a lot of the skeletons have different little like, well, I wouldn't say uh, kind of like what different activity that they're that they're doing on the couch. Some of them are reading books and some are doing different things. But let's go ahead. We'll have Aliana go first. Go. She'll draw her three cards. Okay. Now what you're gonna do with that? I'm gonna go with a three. Okay. And not a three, I mean four. No, you can't put the four. Yeah, you can't put it on top, remember. If you oh. put it on top, it's gonna be one higher. Okay. So she's putting her skeleton to the side, because anytime you put a skeleton to the side, it has to be one higher or one lower. Now she's gonna put that, and the reason why this works, the five over the four, is because the five is one higher than the four. So remember, you do not have to follow both rules at the same time. Just one whenever you play. Nope, that three can't go there because it's not one lower than the five. Remember that. Oh, that was the four. No, yep, because remember the five is the top mm, card. That sucks. I could have went to put the four down. And well, three and then yeah, the you could have done it that way. Well, all right. Okay, how would we do that way? No, no, no. <laughs> Sorry, too late. Go ahead no. and discard. Now, she has to discard that card to end her turn. Now, it's my turn. I get to draw 
But these cards don't mean anything. It doesn't mean you lose points or like stash, you know? No, it's the first person that fills up the entire couch is the person that yeah. wins. So don't worry um, about this pile. So so now I have a two, five, and a three. Now you're gonna do this in secret. You're not gonna let people know what cards you have in your hand. But for the purpose of this video, I'm just gonna do it like that. So no big deal. Um, okay, so we have a five and a five. So I can't. I don't have a four, and I don't have anything that's higher than a five to go over. Um, I don't have a six either because I need a six in order to put. I need a four or six to put next to the five. I have a three, so I ha I have nothing. I have absolutely nothing, so I have to discard, which sucks. Okay, so I'm gonna discard the five. Aliana's gonna go. I'm gonna go ahead and fill up one card. Okay. So I'm what are you gonna play do? The six. Okay, Does you got. Six go under. Or? Or, no, it goes over. That's fine. Right here. You, you, well, either way, you can go to the side I'm go or. To the side. Okay, so you can yeah, you can go to the side. Okay, I'm gonna do this. The seven. I'm gonna go here. Oh wow. Okay, she's gonna. And then the eight can go here, mm. right? Oh my god. Woo! Oh my god. The and, see, there you go. And that just shows you how fast the games go. She won because she put the six next to the five, which is one higher than the five. And then the seven is one higher than the six, and then the eight is one higher than the seven. Wow, that was so fast. She crushed me instantly. Because I'm right. awesome. You all right, all right, that. all right. I, I can't handle that. We we got to do one more playthrough. <laughs> yeah. I want to do one more playthrough that we actually go we we go down a lot. You know, in the instructions, it actually tells you to play like best out of five or best out of seven because the games go so fast. Mm. All right, so let's go ahead. We're gonna do we're gonna do a quick shuffle here. All right, let's try it one more time. Ready? We draw. I draw one card. Put it on this side. She draws a card. Now they're different it's values. Six, right? They're different values. Okay. This time I'm gonna go first because you beat me last time. I don't like that. Evil. All right. Well, I'm going first. Go ahead and draw your three. I'm gonna put a seven to the side because a seven is one less or one higher than the eight over here. I'm gonna put a nine over top of this. Eight. I'm gonna put a five right. Oh no, I can't do that. I'm gonna put a five right next to her six, because one less or one higher side by side. Okay, so this is like less. Is it go here or here? Which one is that? Four. Oh yeah, you can go to the side if you want to do one less. But it has to. If you, anytime you put a card over top, it has to be one higher. Okay, seven. Yep. Yeah, so you can do that mm -hmm. because it's one higher. You should have gone over here. You can. You should have done a oh, side by side because. Yeah, yeah, Thanks for helping me. Yeah, I helped you. you be helping she was trying to do the one higher over top, but I said you might as well just do the side by side because you can get an additional uh, couch. Nah, uh, I don't think you can do anything with the nine. Nope. Okay. Yeah, the nine is garbage there. All right, so I'm gonna go now. Let's see. I'm gonna put a seven here because it's next to her six, so it's one higher or one lower than the six. Wait, did you place one next to there when you, when you um. Put all your cards down, or you just, no, no, or no, you just no, use them all. I, I use them all. Yeah. Okay. So if you have no more cards left in your hand, you can just you don't have to worry about discarding. Yeah. Uh, so I'm gonna put a three. I think I'm gonna put a three over here because it's one less than the four, and then I'm gonna put an eight here because it's one less than a nine. Yeah, you never know. You could win. See, there you go. There you go. That's I just used some good strategy there. Ha ha. I went from that to an eight and. Matter of seconds. Okay, so I'm gonna place this here. I mean, I could actually put the eight on top of the seven. That would have worked too. Yep, there you go. You put eight on top of the okay. seven. I'm gonna put one, a three here. Yeah, because it's next to the four, it's a one okay, less than I don't the four. Think I can do anything else you can't one. do it anything with the one. My God, look at that. She's got four couch seats already covered. Dude, dude, what is going on? Um, all right. Oh, well, here we go. I'm gonna put the five because it's next to her six. It's one okay. lower, one higher. I'm going to put a six over here, covering her six because it's one higher than the five that I just put down. And I'm going to put a two right here because it's one lower than the three. It's next to hers. Ha ha! I've got four now. I just one away from a win. I'm okay. one away from a win. You are going down. This is my victory. Okay, so this, I'm going to put this here. All right. Uh, oh, wait, how? You can't do that. It's got to be one higher than the six or one less or more than this five next to it. Wait, isn't, I know, but this is lower than the six, like. No, if you, so what you do is, if you put it over top of the card and you're not doing side by side, it has to be one higher. Uh, yep, so this is one lower than the three. You're okay, right. Okay, can I put this somewhere? Uh, no, I don't think twos can go anywhere. I think that you're, you're stuck with a two. Discard one of your twos. Oh no, you can put a two right here because one less than the three. Oh yeah, 
on that side. Okay. But that that, that other five, there's no place to put it. There's no place to put the other five. Sure. Oh no, wait. Put it oh here. yeah, you put it right there because it's one less yeah. side by side. I was confused because I was like, I could put it right there. Or yeah, whatever, yeah, that's good. That's good. Wow, you got four couches again. Unreal. And look, I can't do anything. I have two eights and a nine. You have to get a. Um, uh, I I can't. You have to get a seven or. Uh, yeah, I need a seven, six, four, or yeah, or I need a. Wow. Okay, so I need to discard one card. Now I draw. Go okay. ahead, Aliana, and. I got a seven. Yep, and she wins again. Unbelievable, because a seven is one higher than the six that she just threw that over top of. Jeez, I cannot win on videos against my daughter ever, 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 ever. Yeah, I won right. that one with the ghost ladder one again. My one, God. And I, and I won this one. That's insane. That's insane. Okay, so this is Couch Skeletons, guys. It's a super small, cute game. Easy portability, easy fun, quick games. And uh, apparently I'm really bad at this and she's got my number on it. So we will see you guys on the next video. Bye. Bye. Bye, fellow humans.